few bands have had such a bloody and controversial backstory as a musical act compared to one that originated out of Oslo, Norway and have been around since the mid-80s. They are a frightening Norwegian black metal band fittingly called Mayhem. No amount of warning can prepare you for how truly insane this band was. Mayhem was founded in 1984 and have been a huge influence on the entire black metal genre. They are associated with suicide, church burnings and murder. The original members included Aistin Orseth, originally called Destructor but later changed to Euronymous, Jorn Stubert, also known as Necro Butcher, and drummer Shekel Mannheim, who simply went by his surname. As with every band, there were some changes to the lineup, and Per Pele Olin, also known as Dead, and Jan Axel Blomberg, or Hellhammer, joined the group, and they progressed from musical act to the extreme side of performance artists. Dead began to wear corpse paint, covering his face with black and white makeup to look like a corpse, and would later claim that they were the first band to do this. Dead would also bury his clothes the night before a show to give it that recently risen from the grave look. On stage, the band was gruesome and ruthless. Dead would cut himself with a hunting knife or broken glass, and Mayhem would often use dead animals impaled on stakes as part of the show. Things only got more violent around 1990, when the band members moved to an old house in the forest near Oslo to rehearse for their next album. Their bassist, Necro Butcher, went on to say that they started to get on each other's nerves all the time. They weren't really friends towards the end, and that there were incidents of gunplay and stabbing. In April of 1991, Dead committed suicide, leaving behind a note to explain his reasons, and lyrics to a new song he had written. His bandmate Euronymous found the body, went to the store to buy a camera, and took pictures of the gruesome scene, and the band used it as a cover for the next album. As if that wasn't horrifying enough, Euronymous picked up bits of dead skull, giving certain pieces away and selling others. That was enough for Necro Butcher, who quit the band, leaving it with only two members. In 1992, Euronymous would hire three session musicians. Varg Vikernes, known as Count Grishnak, Snora Rook, also called Blackthorn, and singer Attila Sihar. While creating their new album, they had planned to blow up the Nadaros Cathedral to coincide with the album release, but that plan was halted because of a murder. Vikernes, aka Count Grishnak, got into an argument with Euronymous on August 10, 1993, and the Count stabbed him 23 times. He was then arrested, charged, and convicted with murder, and sentenced to 21 years in prison, the maximum that Norway law will allow. He was released in 2009. Blackthorn, who had been waiting downstairs, was charged with complicity in murder and sentenced to eight years in jail. Once again, the group had only two members, and that was the end of them, for a while. Over the years, Mayhem has reunited several times, put out new material, and were touring in Europe until the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic.